Hello, I'm Luke Franks, I'm in the golf buggy, and we are backstage at the final of The Voice UK. Yeah, we've got four very nervous finalists rehearsing just behind here. Matt, Mike, Andrea and Leah. Let's go chat to them, see what's in store on tonight's show. It's final night, this is it, all the final preparation. Final night, oh my goodness. What's going through your head? What are you thinking? And that it's final night, yeah. oh my goodness. <laughs> Just that over and over Just again. Just that. The week has been mega, it's been so busy. Really enjoyed it though. Just been focusing, practicing, you know, uh -huh. the usual. Oh, and then I, I took a helicopter ride to the Olive White Festival. As you do, whatever, not yeah, a big deal. Yeah, that's it, not Very really, you know. It. What's going through your head? Um, just going out there and doing the best I can do. I just feel like, you know, it's final night, it's chill, take uh -huh. it nice and easy. Uh, it's final night tonight, it's, yeah. this is it, it's been a long time coming. And how's Dandria? Dandria seems pretty tight, right? Dandria's good, yeah, yeah. Dandria's going well, yeah. We're, we're quietly confident heading into the final. Now, she's performing with the script with you guys tonight. Yeah, we're doing um, Hall of Fame, a really inspirational song. You know, I think for anybody who knows and met Andrea, you know how inspirational she is as a girl as well. So I think, um, yeah, I think it's a, a great partnership as well. Yeah, well, we're not sure if it's, we're billing it as Andrea and the script or the script on Andrea yet. Okay, okay. <laughs> and it's Andrea Begley's The Script tonight. That's what you've decided. No longer Daniel it? Dunne's The Script, it's Andrea Begley's The Script. I can't believe I'm actually getting the opportunity. I mean, as a fan, it's so exciting. Hello, superstar coach Will I Am. What's up? How you doing? Good? Chilling. Chilling, good. And um, we're, we're, we're on a green screen, right? So basically, we can be wherever you want in the world, like maybe. Egypt. Egypt, boom. Oh, great wild China, bam. Whoa, boom, this is great. It's, I'm having a nice time. Um, so you're duetting with Mr. Will I Am tonight. I am, how fun. No biggie. Like... No, it's just a normal Saturday night for Leah. <laughs> yeah. Leah's cool. I think we're just, you know, keeping her nerves. Uh, you took her on a special little trip this week to relax Yeah, we went to Cannes, bam. We flew in a private airplane, bam. Check that out. I wanted to go on a boat, bam, but no, bam. Now we're here, looking all dope. God. What's the best uh, message you've had from like a friend or someone at home? What's like the best text? Don't burp. Okay, good advice. Good advice yeah, for don't all burp life into the situations. microphone. That was, um, mm. I think that was actually from my father. Agree with that? I, I would, depends on if she's going to hit a high note burp. It could be because, special. Yeah, because Leah's known to hit in high notes. Maybe she got high note burping skills. Uh, have you practiced your winning face yet? Like that's quite important when, when you know, if that happens, you've got to be ready for it. Give it a go, what do you cops, Max, what I like. <laughs> If that did happen, uh -huh. I'll just freestyle it. <laughs> Gaping for shot. For five minutes, like that really pretty, pretty face Don't for five burp minutes. then either, because that would be huge. <laughs> like. Michael Bublé, Robbie Williams and Dizzy Rascal are performing in tonight's final. We caught up with Dizzy and Robbie backstage and found out they had a lot of love for one coach in particular. You're doing your new single with Robbie. Yeah, man. Um, yeah, yeah. Going crazy. I see it. And you make a pretty special entrance as well. Tell us, tell us a bit about it. We're gonna come on the mo uh, mobility scooters. They've got one pimped up for us out there. Yeah, it's amazing. Cool. Um, I read somewhere that you'd quite like to maybe one day do a song with um, our superstar coach, Sir Tom James. Is that is that something you're thinking about? I, he's just an OG, man. He's just like I've met him before. He's a good person to talk to because he's been in the game so long. You know, uh -huh. he's just someone you can just get advice from. He's so sober and so calm and just. He's just seen it all. He's a wicked dude to just be around, full stop. My favourite coach on The Voice, I can't go any further than Tom Jones. If you're going to choose one of our coaches uh, to go on a proper good night out with, who, who would you choose? We'll, we'll leave Tom for Tom, no, oh, no, no, you I'll go with Tom. Tom. Yeah, He'd I'll, get in anyway, surely. Yeah, 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 I'll go with Tom, man. Hey, you do a little bit of a Tom, but uh, mate, I, I'm not sure if it's any good, really. But, uh, you know, I, I, I have been known to do, be able to do a Tom Jones. If you're going to live with someone in a house, you're going to spend time with them every day, um, one of the coaches, who would that be? Tom. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just kidding, mate. Yeah, Just man, kidding. This is the, he's the OG, man. He has been my favourite uh, coach and will always be my favourite coach, no matter what he does. I don't want to keep like, me bread in him and that. Like, <laughs> he's, he's the guy, man. Yeah. Fair play. A lot of love for Sir Tom Jones. Tom, um, Sir Tom Jones, Sir exactly. Tom Jones. Yeah. Uh, we're getting each uh, finalist to teach us a little something, right? Um, so I wondered if you could do me just a snippet of a vocal warm-up. Right, we'll do a wee scale. Okay. Um, okay, so... La 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 Wow, regretting my decision almost immediately. Okay, um, you have to hit that top note. <laughs> okay. La 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 I don't know if the coaches would turn their chair. <laughs> <laughs> it's become clear over the over the weeks of the voice that you, you're a big hit with the ladies, Mike. Your voice does things to me that it really, really shouldn't. <laughs> Give us your best kind of chat up line. I don't imagine you'll need to use it, but pretend um, pretend I'm a girl, okay? And you know we've just met. 
Um, is that okay? Oh, Just yeah. give, me, give me your best line. That's, do do? I don't really do chart lines. All right. I'll sing, I'll sing to the ladies instead. Oh, beautiful. Well, I'm that is sold voice. me. <laughs> team voice. Are you all famous for your high notes? Oh. Um, so I'm going to do a high note. Okay. Just rate me out of 10, basically. Nothing. <clears throat> rate that out of 10? Mm. Okay. Five minus five. <laughs> oh, no, just the zero is the big fat. No, no, zero. it was good, it was good. Hey, it's let's fine. Give you, let's give you a three. I was just about to teach you the worm, because I've heard that you don't know it. Mm, I don't know who you'd be speaking to, but I'm okay. very, yeah, very, very good at the worm. Bring yeah. it. Here we go. Ready? Here we go. Do I get a little. Woo! Woo! I've heard a range of body parts there. All, right. all the good muscles working. So I'm going to show you now how yeah. it's meant to be done. Sure. Here we go! No! Matt Henry doing the work. Do you know what? I'm not even gonna pretend. Yeah, yeah, a lot of that, isn't it? A lot of, uh, not worth the pain, I don't think, but. It really hurts. <laughs> this is it. The coaches are ready. The finalists are ready. Clearly, I'm not quite ready. Need to sort my hair out, get a better shirt. But it's happening tonight, 7.15, BBC One. We're gonna crown the winner of The Voice 2013. See you there.